Hello again. As expected, those storms stayed away, but we did get the showers and they streamed in from the east, falling around the Dangnong Ranges and down into the southeastern suburbs. So the showers and the cloud kept the temperature down. We had a Sunday high of just 15.2 here in the city and it was a lot colder than yesterday in all suburbs. We're basically going to put a pause on today's weather and hit repeat for the rest of the week. It is staying cloudy. We'll have showers streaming through, but it's not going to get too cold, thankfully. We are holding on around 12 in the city right now. There is the chance of a shower or two. The wind is icy, but we're only going to drop down to 10. The bulk of today's rain pouring into West and South Gippsland, particularly around the Strasleki Ranges. We've seen up to 60 millimetres in that area today, and it continues tonight. And this is why. You can see the setup here. The main system at play, this deepening low pressure system that's to, the, to our south, and that's going to continue to drive showers into Victoria during Monday and also on Tuesday. We dry out briefly on Wednesday, but the showers return at night with a series of cold fronts ramping up those showers later on this week. So here in Melbourne, showers on Monday and Tuesday. Wednesday starts dry, but we're expecting a burst of heavier showers overnight into Thursday. That's also our warmest days in the outlook. Those colder winds, though, will take us into the weekend. But it's all fairly typical for this time of year. Looking around the nation now, Brisbane and Sydney, that's where you'll want to be for the warmer weather this week. Lots of sunshine there tomorrow, but there are showers streaming through Perth, Adelaide and also in Hobart. So that is what we are expecting here in Victoria. Scattered showers on and south of the ranges, with pockets of showers pushing into the north by the afternoon. It's a cool start to the week statewide. We're under mostly cloudy skies. A moderate west to southwesterly wind that's going to freshen down along the coast. Closer in, plan for a cold, breezy Monday. We're under grey skies. Showers could fall anywhere, but most likely out in the eastern suburbs. And on the other side of the bay, Geelong, windy with showers atop of 14 if you're there. The city starts on 10. We're also heading for a 14 degree high. It is going to feel chilly and you might even get caught under a shower or two. Then looking ahead, it's 15 degrees on Tuesday. Showers easing during the day. So Wednesday Day is dry to start. The showers return from the afternoon. It's a top of 16. 16 again on Thursday, but it's going to be windy with showers and then we're going to start cooling down. 14 with showers on Friday. We're down to 13 on Saturday with a few showers as well. At this stage, we're all drying up by Sunday, a top of 14 degrees to end the week. But tomorrow, we are starting this week under grey skies. We'll get a shower or two. 14 degrees is your Monday high and there's lots of showers to come after that, Blake, but not anything out of the ordinary for this time of year. Week, all right. <laughs> Unlike yesterday's hailstorms. Thank you, Sonia. That is 7 News for now. Thanks for making us part of your Sunday. From the team, good night.